Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video of my Let's Play 7 Days to Die. This is the Stay Within series where I need to stay within a shopping mall and I can't like, uh, cannot leave. So, what we're doing here is, I'm just going to get out of my little mind. Um, I've been digging, yeah, I've been digging. I've been going through this like crazy over the last couple of weeks. Um, actually, not the last couple of weeks, what am I saying? Um, over the last night or so. Um, I don't know why I said last couple of weeks, but anyway, it is what it is. But as you can see, I've done a bit of digging and uh, for two counts. Obviously, resources being one, but also more importantly, I need to find um, any other resource other than, um, uh, what do you call it, uh, stone or and or um, clay. That's basically where we're at here at the moment. So um, as soon as I find my way into some other type of resource, I'll be a happy person, believe me. Um, but anyway, I'm going to try and attempt to get out of here. I don't know why I'm, I'm having such difficulty in doing so, but it, we are sort of trying to... What the hell is going on? Why can't I get out of here? What is happening with this? Alrighty, and I managed to get my way out. Jeez, that was a pain. I have no idea why that had happened at all. But um, let's go back to default. And it is a little bit early in the morning, I know that. But what we're going to do, I think it's high time that I actually start building up a horde base. Yeah, I have not been able to, well, I have not actually been, uh, been doing that for ever. And I kind of need to do that. So. Yeah, that's pretty much what today's video is going to consist of. I've thought of a base, and I know what I'm going to do. It's just a matter of getting it done and implemented, I guess. So, um, I guess we're going to use this space over here, because I don't think we're going to need a big amount of space here. And, oh, jeez, you guys just spawned in, didn't you? Alright, okay. Well, I'm going to have to clear some, uh, some zombies here. Hello. Oop, nurse. Nurse, relax. Um, okay. Oop, you two, relax for me. I am out of stamina. Oh no. Oop, come on. No, oh, no, 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 no. Why am I out of stamina? Come on. How am I missing? Seriously, how was I missing all of that? I have no idea. Come on. Come to me. Take a swing. Take a swing. There you go. There you go. Perfect. Alright, finally. Anyway. So what I might do is I might um may do it from here. Um I think that might be the way to way to do it. Cause I would imagine that these guys will be coming out of from here somewhere. And we can start from here. Okay? And essentially what I want to do is I'm gonna make um Basically like a corridor base, I'm going to have a, a section where I need, um, that I'll, that the zombies will basically run off and, um, and drop to the floor, run back, rinse and repeat, that's pretty much the way it's going to happen here. So, yeah, and the way that I want to do this is I'm going to get a few high of, um, uh, flagstone here, and, oh really, you can't really center that, oh. Anyway, that's sort of centered. Okay. And... I'm going to start it from there. Build it up from there. So what I'm sort of trying to work out is... These guys getting up here somehow. And I think I might want to do it too wide. I think too wide is going to be the way to go. So we're just going to do that. Perfect. Jump and jump. Alright, cool. And then they're, they're just going to go down that pathway like that. I think. Did I do that right? I have absolutely no idea. I don't know if I did. Hmm. I think I should have started with one. I think. I'm just trying to envision it now. And... No, I think maybe two might be good. But let's see. Let's see how we go. I think I've got it now. So this is what we're looking at so far. So basically the zombies are going to run up here and then just going to run down this little part of the corridor here. And yeah, and then eventually what I'm going to do here, I'm going to get some um, some inclines and push them out. 
and then eventually um, I'll create my little hidey hole where I'm going to be hiding from here. But that's pretty much how I wanted to sort of do it. I know it's pretty simple, pretty easy. Um, but look, it, it works, it's tried, it's proven, and I like it. So I'm going to do it. And what I want to do here is cap off this. So this um, allows the zombies, if they're running around from the corner here, they can just sort of run up and then they can sort of come up from here. So yeah, just wanted to sort of get that happening and there we go cool so that's completed and then eventually I'm going to definitely upgrade these to a uh, cobblestone spec at, at the very least because I'm going to need to and yeah that, that's going to need to happen um, soon enough but what are we looking at here actually I might just get rid of that and I shall open up this and do that once more and then how we're going to do this is we're just going to go another new shape we're going to go inclines which tips sorry and I think I need to go into the advanced rotation for this one here just to sort of make this one happen and that's how we're going to do it so basically that we're going to go at least I don't know maybe four five possibly even six out I think that's way enough that's actually heaps yeah we're not going to need any more than that I don't think so one two three four five six yeah that's that's heaps and then we're going to repeat that step on the other side and do the exact same thing boom 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 and then yeah that's six there and then eventually this will serve its purpose at some point um, we shouldn't have any problems from zombies breaking these down because they've already got a clear line of path back to us and all that we need to do from this part here is um, pretty much construct the other part that the other section that I wanted to do that's pretty much it that's pretty much where we're gonna sort of leave it have I done this too small I don't know if I've done this a little bit too small I think I may have yeah I think I might have done this a little bit on the smaller side I think I should have gone one more up honestly I don't know Because the, what, that's, how much is this? One, two, three, four. Hmm. Yeah, I think I might have a problem here, guys. I think I might have a problem. I think I did this a little bit too small. But you know what? We're going to roll with it. Because that's what we're going to do. I would think that this should not be an issue. I don't foresee this being an issue, to be honest with you. Anyway, is what it is, guys. So, what I'm going to do is go back to block shape. And then pretty much cap this fella off here. Oops. Well, I'm going to need that anyway. So, a little, little bit of a platform for me. Uh, but definitely, we're going to need to put a a support in place there we go have a look at that boom all right and then pretty much from here it's just going to consist of my little my little protection here so i don't think i'll need that much to be perfectly honest with you guys so i would think a platform such as this should be sufficient um let's go up let's have a look have a look and see what I've done here so zombies will not be able to run across like I just done here so that's going to be fine for me I think I might be able to fill this out a little bit on either side just to sort of get a little bit of a um, a little bit of a podium kind of thing happening here which is yeah I think that might be oops no I shouldn't have done that that's all right I'll fix that up and then I can just go on this side and do the same thing there we go okay look at that okay I think I like that and then from here um, I can sort of build this up how I want it and I'll probably have like a little area exposed up top so I can shoot some birds and things like that if that happens um, but I think that's pretty much where I sort of wanted to get to but the other thing I wanted to show you guys as well is, and this is going to be the use of the um, uh, the witch tips again. 
is I'm going to make like a like a little funnel. Um, I think it's blocks and then wedge tip. I can't even remember. It's been such a long time since I've done it. But the way that I want this trick to work as well, because these guys are going to be pretty much running in a straight line. So I need to find a very particular um, shape. And once I find it, I'll let you know exactly what I'm thinking. Um, you are... No, it's the incline, it's that, um, gosh, I don't even know where it is now, I can't even find it, where is it? It's, it's not that, definitely not, but, um, so basically it's a, it's a flat piece block, and that's what I'm looking for here, and I have no clue as to where and how I'm so oh that's it half block found you and then basically with the half blocks oops boom I'm just gonna build it up like that and you might be asking why am I doing it this way well I'm gonna do it on this side as well and once I find the the shape perfect these guys are going to be running in the center because they're not going to intrude on the half of this block here. So they're going to be pretty much in the center of this. And then that way that allows me as the shooter on the other end is just to shoot them from the middle. And that's basically how I'm going to do it. Oops, that wasn't supposed to happen. Gosh, I make these mistakes all the time. Anyway, I'm not too sure if you guys would do the same thing as me in terms of the way that I um, would go about things. But anyway... But let me know, what do you guys think in the comment section here? Does this, um, do you think this would sort of work? I know you would have did this and he did this quite successfully, but you know, this is a completely different series. I'm on limited resources here. So yeah, that's basically where I'm sort of going to be um, at and working with what I have at the moment. And then if we do a three high, I think that'll be more than enough. Because that's high enough. And I think that should be fine. Uh, I think that should be all right. And then if I can continue to do this, continue to do that, and then I'll get it to about here because I need to work out exactly how I need the, the little wedge inclines to work out for me. So we'll do that. And then I can go back onto this side here and finish this off, I think. And I think this would be good. And I'm gonna have to break this down because that was a mistake, of course. So is what it is okay uh, come on buddy break for me break for me thank you and we shall copy this rotation put it back on side here and we just continue on and build out this part here Oop. and not drop of course so the reason why I'm gonna leave it at this height here is I don't have the luxury of getting as many resources as I would like so there's not much I can sort of do from that point there but we will work with what we've got and um, yeah and just sort of work from there because there's only so much that I can do with this until come horde night I know there's a little bit time in advance here I've, I think I've I think I'm actually making excellent progress with this to be honest with you so um, once this is ready to go I'll be ready to go and hopefully by then I should have enough resources that I've um, mined and I should be able to upgrade this to at least cobblestone spec and we'll get some wood bars in and yeah we should be good to go but that's pretty much the basis of it like <laughs> nice and easy it really doesn't take you guys that long to make and that's what I really like about this um, in particular so what I might do from here is let's go to a new shape go back to the wedge chip and oop I just had it come on come on come on it's going to be difficult right now okay here we go so I think I might make it about there or should I make it there oh that's a good question Let's make it there. Yeah, that'll work. That will work. All right. And then if I just jump up, three, perfect. And then I can do the exact same thing on the other side. Once I get to the right point, 
Oop, I just had it. Oh, completely messed that one up. Come on. There we go. Cool. Three. And then I can finish off with the... Um, oop. How about if I just go copy shape? That'll work. Copy rotation and... Copy shape. There we go. How about that? And this way, everything actually lines up too. And then... Oop. Copy rotation. Jump up on that. And then... Cool. Alright. And then that's going to be my little horde of zombies running down here. That, and they're going to be running in the middle. And they shouldn't be running on anywhere else other than that. So, yeah. I'm actually really happy with that now. So, I think I've done well. And now we can actually finish off this part here. Which, hopefully, I might have everything. I hope so. Um, and let's go... Copy this rotation, boom, and let's just jump up, perfect, two, three, and I think I might squeeze this in, this is awesome, um, shape, go back to the tip, and I need to do it like that, no, and not fall over, <laughs> but I think I've done really good here, I think I'm really happy with the, the general progress of this, I mean, I had just en pretty much enough to get me where I needed to be with all this and we just need to do this one now I think I just had it of course I did come on you come on come on no yes cool and then these guys will just fall off the edge there once they sort of come to the end they'll fall off they'll drop off and then they will race back and start again. Basically rinse and repeat. So very, very effective base. And I'm pretty happy with that. And I don't know what I want to do now is I'll probably just, I guess I'll, I'll get some stuff prepared for this side here. And I don't know, what do I, I think I might make something here. I don't know yet. Um, I might like make like a little storage container. I might break something out. I don't know yet. But I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to have to fill this out a little bit just so I've got a bit of a platform happening here. Um, but yeah, I think that's pretty much what I wanted to achieve with this today because, as you can see, um, yeah, that's pretty much where I wanted to be with this. I'm wor I am worried. Don't get me wrong. I am worried about these guys dropping in, breaking all this. Hopefully, that won't be the uh, won't be the thing. But what I'm hopeful for is they're just going to run up here and they're just going to attack this. If it fails, I don't know what I'm going to do. I honestly don't know what I'm going to do. But um, we'll try and get some contingencies put in place. But we'll see how we go with that. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think about this one in the comment section, guys, because I'll be interested to know what your thoughts are. What do you guys think? Um, everything else in between, I guess, really, but, yeah, um, you know, Horde Night is going to be on day 10, it won't be on day 7, so I did extend that out, so I am following, um, Cage A48's, um, uh, challenge on this one here, so hopefully you guys will enjoy it, and if you didn't, well, look, let me know, give me some constructive criticism, feedback, all that sort of good stuff, and, you know, hopefully that will, um, help me to do a lot more better, I guess, that's where I sort of wanted to be with that. But I think it would be a good time to go ahead and leave it here. It's a nice day outside, as you guys can see in the zombie land. We will definitely be coming into Eden Mall after day 10. After we've survived the Horde, we'll be moving day. We'll move into here. We'll see what's up with this place. And hopefully, um, we shall have a great time. Anyway, I'm, gonna, I'm out of here. Take it easy, guys. And catch you next time.